Hey guys, it's Kenny Boulder with another Pokemon unpacking. And we got a special, a very, very special box tonight. So I've been very fortunate in being able to get some Shining Fates. Uh, basically, Shining Fates has been impossible to get. Literally, they had all these cards to get in the very beginning and then poof, gone. So I was able to get a premium collection box. And some of it was restocked over like the snowstorm that we had in Colorado. And yeah, we, we were able to get it. So obviously it's a pretty big deal because uh, Shining Fates is just hard to get. Even though Battle Styles is out, Battle Styles has been going out back and forth and a lot of people have been getting that. I did actually a video for my 200 followers slash subscriber special. So we're gonna go straight into the meat and grind here, y'all. So check this out, guys. We have a Shining Fates premium box collection of the Shiny Crobat V Max. So these, all right, let's actually, let's go open, or look in the back here real quick. Oh, sorry about that, y'all. So, Shining Fates, Premium Collection, VMAX. Rule the sky, rule the night sky with Crobax, Crobat VMAX. Crobat bites with the power of precision, I'm sorry, with power and precision, and the Pokemon VMAX version comes out of nowhere. This Simon flyer, flyer can change your game and enhance your collection with all the potent striking force of a night flying Pokemon. You'll find helpful allies, skilled trainers, and other treasures in the Pokemon TGC Shining Fates booster packs. Embrace the night and fly with the stealth and speed in true Crobat style. I'll never see it coming! Da -na -na -na. Okay. Anyway, so you, this is what you get, guys. You get, in the Pokemon training card, Game, Shining Fates Premium Collection, Shiny Crobat V Max includes one etched promo card featuring Shiny Crobat V, one etched promo card featuring show of Shiny Crobat V Max, one oversized Crobat featuring uh, Shy Bat, or Shy Guy, wow, I can't fucking read tonight. Shiny Crobat V Max, one metallic, metallic coin featuring Crobat, and seven Pokemon booster packs of Shining Fates, and a code card of the online game. That's a pretty big deal. Um, I want to say these boxes had like 10 packs in the past. They usually had maybe eight, I want to say, like four each. So seven, it's kind of a weird number to get. Cause I don't know, maybe, maybe because of the coin or some of the extra cards they give you, they are like, you know what, we're, not, we're just gonna give these kiddos seven packs now instead of the usual eight or 10. So, we're just gonna go straight to and open these bad boys up. So again, I want to say the box is pretty hefty. I want to say that this was about three nine 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 on retail, and finding this on retail is impossible. You literally have to either pre-order or you have to get in line at seven in the morning at like a Target or Walmart to get these guys. And I don't even think you can get these guys in store anymore. Like. The drought of trying to find Pokemon cards is so fucking real. Like, you cannot find Pokemon cards to save your life. So, I got lucky. I went to Target at 7 in the morning. And luckily, they did one per customer, and I was able to get one. Because, you know, that's how it should be. But in stores like Walmart, have fun. It's a free-for-all. People are going to, like, shove and push and try to get these cards from you. So, let's open these guys up now. Okay, Doki. So... The box is really nice. I want to say it's like not your typical like cheap ass Pokemon box, you know? It's kind of like hefty in a way. Like there's some go gilded gold and not gold. It's like bronze, you know? It's like nice and bronzy. So I'm trying to rip this fucking thing apart, my guy. What the fuck? There you go. Nice. So there's the box. It's pretty big again. And here's like the actual meat. So let's bring you down just a little bit. So flat off the bat, this is kind of pretty sick. Like it's it's heavy. It's kind of heavy. It's like definitely you know like this is worth some stuff here. You know you're, you're getting some of the premium shit here, y'all. So first off the bat, we're gonna check out the coin. So this is not metallic. I mean, it, it, it feels metallic, but it isn't. It's like that kind of same plastic. But compared to other coins, this one's way bigger. And actually, 
it's like the size of like a 50 cent kind of coin, you know? Like it can fit my palm in my hand. These things are usually like kind of small, like quarter size. So this is pretty cool. And it's very shiny, again, very shiny, very pretty kind of looking coin. So I, I appreciate the Pokemon company trying to step up their coin collection because I know a lot of people really care about this and they want these gosh damn things. So, like, again, you can just see it, the swirls and the spark, like, the dazzle in it. Like, they definitely stepped up their game with making these at the very least. And again, you can see in the very back, it's a Pokeball, it says Pokemon. So, you can't see in the, it just says Pokemon, yeah, so. Nice Pokemon, Pokemon. Uh, next is gonna be, let's put the coin away. It is gonna be that promo card. And yeah, this promo card feels wow, amazing. So, obviously, uh, each one gets these, which is pretty cool, I have to say. Like, you don't, don't expect this, really, getting it. So, let's look at this other one, actually, too. So, you get two promo cards. Instead, instead of getting one pack, they're like, we're just getting, you know, the kiddos one promo card each. And again, this is, this is legit. This is legit. So... It's, it's basically like a sparkly, secret rare kind of type card. Uh, Crobat V, and I know these are probably a bit more because Crobat in the meadow right now is pretty good. And people want that stuff, so you can tell that it's like, you know, again, it's special edition, it's a promo card. It says SWH, or sorry, SWSH098. And the centering's pretty good too, I want to say. Setting is really good actually, and it's not bent or anything like that, which is kind of nice. Uh, so the promo card again, like, I'm I'm happy with the promo card. Obviously, they gave us two, so here's the other one. So this is the first one, this is the V, and here's the second one. This is the V Max version. Wow, incredible! So each 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 collector uh, one gets two, so you get one of each basically. And the V Max, I want to say, is it feels the same. A kind of crisp feel, a crisp, more like the the etching around is really, really nice enough where it's like, you know, it's like a fancy card. And again, it has like the stars around where it makes it look like it's kind of like a secret rare, which is again, pretty cool. Uh, this one is more chunkier though. Like, look at that. It's, this is like compared, compared to this guy, it's way chunkier. Yeah, I'm, I'm so inf informational, okay? I have seven packs tonight. This one's uh, again, he's a V, but this was a V max. So when we say V-Max, like, we want to put it to the max here, okay? So he's a big boy. This Crobat is a very big boy. And again, same thing. You get the promo card, you get the stuff, information, all that good stuff. Hey, Chris, thanks for stopping by. I really appreciate it. And I will always will be informational. And the centering, again, it's pretty good. There's, like, no any... I mean, maybe there's, like, a little weird dot right there, but that's about it, though. I don't see any other issues besides that weird dot right in the middle. Actually, it's gone now. Cool! So, cool stuff right here so far. Get some good stuff here, guys. And of course, how can I not forget the VMAX card. So this is the same card, but very bigger. Much bigger, actually. It's like literally the size of my face. So, it's the same etching. You can feel that, you can see it. You can definitely smell like it's like buttery smooth. And sorry, I can't put this on there. It's way too small. So I can't, I can't sleeve it. I'm sorry, gang. I can't sleeve the card. But, this is probably the most interesting, uh, like, big size card I've seen. So, butter smooth. Yeah, that's right, butter smooth. You know, so. It's really, yeah, that Chungus. He's so chungy. Literally, he can fit inside the, like, the, the regular one can fit inside him. That's how chungy he is. He's so big. You know, I know these are worth a little bit of money. But I like collecting them as well because like I have literally a deck of like large cards now because I've been opening for the past like couple months now so it's kind of nice to have like a big shiny holographic one though most of them are holographic I should say actually all right here we go the packs this is what we want to go through so you get seven packs four on this side seven on this side they fit in the 25th anniversary binder. All right, I have to check that out. I actually got some binders as well. So, four, or sorry, seven packs. Seven packs, okay? So this is the last pack. We're gonna save this guy for last. 
Four on this side, seven on the other side, so 11 packs. No, no! We have seven packs, seven packs, not 11. I swear to God. All right, we're gonna open this guy first. Let's go. So, first Shining Fates pack of the night, guys. So, again, Shining Fates, 10 cards. You get the whole, I mean, this feels a little hefty. You get, yeah, there you go, a little, 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 little reveal a Shining Destiny. Shiny Pokemon are extraordinary that they've almost never seen, and trainers who catch them are considered quality quite lucky. And yet, they can be yours in the Pokemon TCG Shining Face Expansion! More than 100 Shiny Pokemon appear on a beautiful etch cards, alongside with more than 30 Pokemon V and V and Pokemon V Max, including the spectacular, look at that, look at that, they're even mentioning the spectacular, Shiny Charizard in its Giga Max form. Seize your destiny and expand your collection with the Shiny Face expansions. Am I watching late night TV right now? You are. You are. Sorry, 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 sorry. I just, there's seven packs. I, I like my voice, okay? I like my voice. I like my voice. Forgive me. All right, we're gonna open this now. Here you go, here you go, Kenton. Here you go, this, this is what you've been waiting for. This is the moment of truth right here, y'all. The moment you've been waiting for. Get rid of the promo card. But there's more! Wait! There's more! Exactly. Alright, four to the front. Alright, I'm ready. I think we need to replace your foot emo with the pop cap. Nice. I, I think I'd be down for pop cap. I opened this crow backpack last night, got a few shinies out. Arc Luden! Oh my god, Arc Luden, thank you so much for the follow. I really appreciate that. Welcome to my channel. We are opening Pokemon cards right now, so you're right in time. Um, I will add that uh, after the stream, Kenson, so you can count on me doing that, because I think, I think the, I agree with you that we should definitely add the, uh, you know, the, the, the pop cat for sure, so. Anyway, we got energy. Energy? We got a Thawaki, again, classic Pokemon. Uh, not classic, it's like, you know, it's a new one. It has two sticks, it's a tree, it's a monkey, you know, we're turning the monkey, we love that shit in this channel, so pretty good right here. And then we got a... Ball guy, nice. Ball guy would be a fun cosplay. Again, uh, Chris, we gotta do ball ball guy, okay? We got we gotta dress up as ball guy. Just get a giant pokeball, put on our heads, and be extra buff with like a red t-shirt and some shorts. So let's do ball guy. Let's fucking do it. And then we got a rusted sword. Again, it's just a sword. Uh, you know, Pokemon Sword and Shield. You got the sword, it looks rusty. That's that's about it. Nothing else to say. Uh, this guy looks pretty, you know, CGI'd. And then you got a Nick Kit. Again, outside your house, prowling and looking for food. You know, cat- or uh, not cats. Wolf- foxes! There you go. Foxes are very crafty creatures. So I'm sure Nick Cat is a foxy fella trying to get some fox and stuff. Uh, you got a Rowlet with a bow tie, though it looks like a bra. Uh, floating around, having a good time. Again, my mind is not in the gutter, it's just- he, he's just flying around. You know, with this bow tie bra, so good stuff. And just gotta go through a bunch of animals. We'll get there. Exactly. Look, it's 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 a ho ho, or a hoot hoot. Uh, then you get a spinnerack. Spinnerack is terrifying because again, I'm not a fan of spiders. I'm sorry, but I do like the art style and I, the face on the spinnerack's back is always appeasing. It's just like a blue face, you know, like a face that doesn't really say much. So pretty cool stuff. Then we got a horsey. Again, Horsey is an original Pokemon. I like it just because, you know, there's all these statues of Horsey's like splitting water from its like mouth or whatever. So pretty cool stuff. And it's a dragon Pokemon. So there you go. Uh, you got a, oh look, Morpeko, yay! So Morpeko is cute. I gotta admit, you know, even though it's like a Pikachu-like clone, I think it's pretty goddamn cute. And you got a Shuckle and you got a Pika Pack, I think. And they're eating berries, I think, so. If I can compare this analogy to Pokemon, trying to get Pokemon cards, the fans are Mepeko. You know, this is the line for like Target at 7 in the morning. You have me right here, just like on the fucking wall, slobbering, waiting, and you know, the fucking spit coming down my chin saying, I gotta get those Pokemon cards, I gotta get it. And the Pokemon cards are just right there, waiting for me to grab. Then you got the scalpers just like counting down, waiting. Just, you know, having a good time. And, and you know, they have all these hands here because, you know, there's always like a bunch of them here, the scalp. And the Pekpeko is like just the random ass people, you know, they're just there. 
they just showed up on a target at uh, 7 in the morning and they're like, why are these clowns out here waiting for Pokemon cards? So, this is what it looks like. Then you got a- wow. Holy <laughs> shit! Oh. We got the fucking Charizard VMAX on our first pack. Oh my god. <laughs> Guys! 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 Oh my god! We fucking got it! Yo! Yo, guys! Guys, we got the fucking Charizard V Max! Oh my god, guys, like, get the little hurry the fuck up, let's go! No, one second, guys, look at this! It's so amazing! We I mean my hands are shaking right now. My hands are shaking right now, but yeah, we got it. Oh my god. We fucking got it. Do it again. Okay, okay. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna go. Jesus Christ, man. But we did. Yeah, we did, chat. And then we got a yes. uh, full art uh, center base V. And again, pretty cool. Nice. It's uh, it's pretty centered. I like it just because, you know, you know, it's just a guy kicking a fucking ball of fire here. So pretty cool stuff here. And um, yeah, no, we, we got it. Dude, no, no. I, I got I got guys for real. We, we fucking I got to put this away. Gotta put this away right fucking now. Let's put this away. Yo, dude. Oh my god. $380? Holy shit, guys. This is my first Charizard. Ever. My first Charizard, chat. This is my first Charizard V Max here. The centering is pretty good. Again, that's just some dust here. There's no actual stuff here. That's just, uh, you know, that's my fingerprints. Yeah. Centering is good. And then, again. First pack. This is our first pack of the night. First pack of the night, we got the fucking Charizard VMAX. It was priced at 600 earlier, but not anymore. I mean, again, you know, I, I, I know people are here for the Charizards just because it's a lot of money. I get that. But... I'm a collector, I collect Pokemon cards, I have, you know, I love Pokemon, so this is good in my collection. So, I'm, I'm happy I got it though, don't get me wrong, like this is again, it's amazing, and it's so detailed. You know, it's a black Charizard, the flames around him, it's a V-Max, again, it's the Giga, Giga, Giga T-Max Charizard. So we got it though, we fucking got it. Uh, thanks, thanks for being here chat, I really appreciate it. Obviously, uh, I open Pokemon cards every Wednesday by the way, at 8pm, uh, Mountain Time, so. And I'm Kenny Boulder, so thank you so much for joining us. And look at that, look, look, look at this belly, it's pretty nice and fiery, and the flames. Good stuff, good stuff, good stuff. All right, next pack. Next pack, okay? Can we, re can we recreate that? Can we recreate the magic, y'all? Can we recreate the magic? I, I think we can, I think we can re recreate the magic. I think we can recreate it, y'all. All right. Port to the front. And someone please clip that. Oh my god. If someone can clip that, that'd be amazing. Sorry. Uh, we got energy. We got a Tropius. Tropius. Pretty cool. Again, Gen 2 po or Gen 3 Pokemon. I love it. It's too great. Alright, I'll, I'll go back. Just give me the time, st uh, time stamp of getting the Charizard. <laughs> I love you, Kenson. Damn, you feisty tonight, my guy. Uh, let's go. Tropius is pretty cool. Uh, again, it's like a giraffe, not a giraffe. It's like a, like a dinosaur Pokemon. I, you know, I, I appreciate that. I, I like dinosaur Pokemon. You got a Elder Goss. Very cool Elder Goss here with the brain of its, you know, of all the con in its head. Not bad, not a bad look. I appreciate that. It's pretty cool. And then you got a Rotom. You know, Rotom is, is just on, you know, Rotom is like the aesthetically pleasing, like, Computer Pokemon, even though it's like a virus, basically. Basically, it's a virus that teaches you things. So, Pepperoni, welcome. Pepperoni, check it out. Check it out. We got it. Pepperoni, check it out. We got the fucking VMAX. First pack. First pack of the night, we got the VMAX already. Look at that. Right there. VMAX. Bam. Done. Uh, again, Rom's pretty cool. Love it. Uh, and then you got a Buzzle, a little lifeguard Pokemon. Again, I would not trust my life with this Pokemon. He's only 65 pounds, okay? Like, I'm about 140 pounds, I wanna say. And I don't think he can save me. Maybe he can get me out of the water, but I don't think he's gonna be able to be life-saving, you know? Like, he can drag me from the, the depths of hell saving, so. And again, 
Holy smokes, good stuff. Next is gonna be a spinner rack again. Again, nice face. A more Peko, again, this is me now. This is me with a fucking VMAX over here, drooling and guzzling my, you know, stuff over here, so good stuff. And you got a Grookey, return the monkey, return the monkey. Grookey is great. You know, I just wanna like rub a, you know, a little piece of rock in my brain, you know, just have a, a good time. And you got a horsey. You got a super rare. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my god. A secret rare uh, evil tall. And this is our second secret rare in a row. So again, we got a Charizard and we got a secret rare uh, evil tall. Back to back. Back to back. Holy shit. What is going on with this fucking thing? And yes. I do want to point out and give a shout out to Kenson. Again, Kenson gave me one of these guys. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it, fam. You are truly the best. Uh, obviously, this is so crazy. I mean, this Prima collection is insane right now. Holy shit. All right, next is going to be a Professor's Research. Again, Professor Juniper. Uh, she's definitely my type, not going to lie. So, uh, Secret Rare. Two back-to-back -back Secret Rares already. So, chat, we are we're on fire right now. Like, I don't know what to say it, y'all, but we are doing really good right now. Holy shit, guys. We got two secret rares back to back. Look at that. Back to back secret rares. All right, next pack. So we got the third pack of the night, number three. Okay, and this is uh, we this is uh, third pack of the night, so we have seven packs total. So pretty good, pretty good. Four to the front. You got energy. You got a team yell towel with the heart. Again, I love the heart in the middle. It's just very kawaii. I appreciate that stuff. It's pretty cute. You got a gym trainer. You know who wears short shorts? I wear short shorts. Pretty cool. Pretty cool stuff. I appreciate these gym trainers running around, having a good time. Then you got a Dartrix with the shuriken around its like, uh, you know, like the thing. So pretty cool stuff. Uh, I love it. I respect the shuriken. I appreciate this little owl Pokemon. Just because it's based like a ninja, you know? It's, it's, it's like the Ambu Black Ops, you know, from Naruto with a little mask. So next is going to be a Yanma, classic dragonfly Pokemon. Uh, you know, I, I, again, I've said the thing, it just spins and it floats again. Then you got Horsey again. You got a Shinx. Again, I, I, I read it, I didn't want to say shits, but it's Shinx. And again, it's a little cute little lion Pokemon. Very cute. I love the electricity around it. I like the background. It's just, you know, it's a cute little Pokemon. Good times. Uh, another Spinarak again. Love you, Smiley. Uh, Grookey. Gotta get the monkey. And wow, another fucking Seeker Rare! Back to back secret rares. Back to back secret rares. What the fuck is going on? What the fuck is going on, guys? We just got back to back secret rares. A secret rare frost moth. Again, it is beautiful. The art is amazing. The eyes, you can see like the glow in the eyes, you know, the blue glow. You can see the, the, uh, the stars around it. Imagine these pulls in 10 packs in a row. Dude. I'm, I'm fucking, I'm going crazy right now. Shining Fates, y'all. Shining Fates. Three secret rares in a row. Tonight. That's insane. Thank you so much, Frostmouth. Really appreciate you being here today. And then finally, but not least, a Celebi non-holographic. Again, I love Celebi. I love this art style because literally it's just flowing in the water with the stars in the background. So I love it. I love Celebi. Celebi is one of my, you know, it's a great Pokemon. Celebi's movie, good movie. Tell her right now. Uh, no, I'm freaking the fuck out right now. So far, we're three to three in secret rares. We got Frostmoth. We got a Yvatol, and we got a fucking Charizard V Max. All in one thing. This is insane. All right, next pack. Pack number four. Can we get five? Can we get four secret rares? Let's go. Can we get four secret rares? That'd be insane. Pack number four, guys. We're halfway there. All right, four to the front. Okay, energy. 
Ball guy again. Classic, classic. I love this guy. Uh, throw wacky again. Again, two, two, you know, two sticks, two sticks. Uh, Luxio. Again, I feel like, uh, wow, I keep saying again a lot. I've seen these cards a lot, okay? I'm gonna say that right now. Luxio is a cute little lion, and I appreciate the aesthetic of the city in the background. That city reminds me of the world that never was. It was a, like a world in Kingdom Hearts, okay? Luxio. I mean, I said Lucio. Oh, I said Lucio. My bad. Luxio. My bad. My bad. Lux Luxio. Thank you so much, Chris. Appreciate that. Then you got a Morpeko. Classic. Very cute. That's me right now with all the fucking jars of fucking secret rares. Uh, Gossip Flower. Uh, I, you know, it's a simplistic art, you know, and I like that. I like it simple. It's nothing fancy. It's just a little Pokemon in the middle. Some flowers here and there. A door in the back. You can't go wrong with that, you know? Can't go wrong with that. And then you got a Rowlitz again, again with the bra. Then you got Horsey, okay? I thought it was like hollow, reverse hollow, but it wasn't. And you got a Snom. Oh, we want the Snoms. I love Snom. Snom is just an adorable Pokemon. Snom just sits there. Snom is so chill. Snom, I, if I saw a Snom on a bench having a good time, I'd be like, yo, can I vibe with you, sir? And I would vibe with you. Though, actually, Snom's taking the whole fucking bench, actually. I don't know how I feel about that. Snob, why are you being greedy, dude? And a reverse hole, Snob. Yeah, okay. Okay, you know, I guess, I guess Snob is, you know, yes! Snob the Snob. <laughs> so reverse holo, pretty cool. Pretty cute guy. Again, he is indeed a thick boy. He hella thick. He a thick boy indeed. Thinking fucking, you know, back to back Snobs. He's like, yup, here's another Snob. So there you go. And then you got a, another Celebi. Interesting, another Celebi. Again, I love the art. I love it. Celebi is a great Pokemon. You know, I get it. Celebi is a, a time-traveling Pokemon who just chills out there. Whew. Okay, three packs left. Pack number, uh, I think six. Yeah, six. Or so five. Pack number five. Number five. Four to the front. All right, we got energy. Got Gym Trainer, nice, nice. You got Gym Trainer over here just having a good time. Again, I really like the, the short shorts. I don't know why. Maybe it's just me, but the short shorts are very, uh, they, they, they fly, you know? They, they cool, they cool. They cool, they cool. I like it. And you got a Tropius. Again, pretty cool guy, awesome stuff. Uh, I really appreciate it just because it's just, you know, it's, it's a chill little Pokemon. So I can't, I, I, I can't, I can't, I can't say no to this guy. He's, he's cute, he's cool. And then, sorry, one second, just gotta check the chat. And then you got a Floatzazel, okay. So I know the other guy, he's a bad lifeguard. I would put my life on this guy. I would absolutely give my life and be like, okay, you can save me. Because this guy, he looks like he's a lifeguard. He, he can definitely save my butt from the pool, so. I'm definitely okay with this, for sure. Next is gonna be a Morpeko, okay. The other Morpeko. So, if I want to again sum up all this whole shit show of Pokemon cards, this is me getting the fucking Charizard, running around. This guy are the scalpers and those people who buy bulk and shit, you know? They buy 13 or 14 Elite Trainer boxes and they're just up there laughing their asses off. They use bots, okay? They use bots and they get the bots to get all the Pokemon cards. And I'm that guy getting that one single Elite Trainer box from all the other. Pokemon fans. These, you know, the, the Snorbull, this is everyone else, unfortunately. These are the casual fans. The, these are the fans who can't get in line in the morning. And I feel bad, because I'm more Petco with that one single thing. So it's me. Uh, next is gonna be a Snom again. Pretty cute, thick boy. You got Horsey, again, pretty cute little guy. I love the Horsey. And then you got a Nick It. Nick is always in trouble because he's trying to get some food or some shit around town. So I'd be terrified seeing Nick just running around. So just saying. And you got a Eevee. Oh, Sophia Panda. Thank you so much for the follow. I'm Kenny Boulder. And again, we're getting so close to our 200 followers Pokemon Sword Marathon. So I appreciate the follow. And if you just joined, we just got the V Max already. So I open Pokemon cards Wednesdays. And I never, never get any Charizard. So this is the first one I've ever gotten on, on stream. So you guys have joined in a historical day here on Kenny Boulder. Uh, Eevee is very cute. I agree. I agree, I agree with uh, Chris over here because it's a swimming. Though I honestly think it's kind of fucked up. Like 
This Eevee's like just swimming across the ocean, you know? And he looks like he's about to like die. Like, what if he's like in the middle of like some like ocean and he's about to fall in, you know, like it's awful. Uh, scary stuff, Eevee. Then you got a wow. secret rare or fourth one of the night. Oh my god. Secret rare toxic toxicity. I can't say that word. Toxicity secret rare. Number four. This is number four. Yeah, this is the secret rare, bro. Secret rare shiny version. Look at that. The shiny toxic stock city. I can't fucking say that word. Holy shit, guys. We are hitting bangers tonight. This is the fourth one. So we got the uh, Crobat VMAX seven packs. Out of seven packs, four of them have, have had secret rares. This is insane. So, uh, yeah, a shiny. Oh my god. Toxicity. Yeah, there you go. Fuck, guys. And again, this is a cool guy. He's like. I think he's normally like blue and he's pink. And, you know, again, the secret rare cards are nice. They feel amazing. They feel like crisp. Like, they feel like genuine, you know? And then you got like the fists, you know, it's just holding. Having a good time. So, holy shit, guys. Look at that. And then we got a non holographic Dradna. Not bad, not bad. Not bad. Yeah, thank you so much. Thanks for stopping by, uh, Zufaf. Play the lottery, you'd win? I do, absolutely. If I win the lottery, I'd be, I'd be great. Uh, Dreadnought is, again, a turtle Pokemon. I love turtles. You know, as the famous YouTuber once said, I like turtles. I love turtles. Dreadnought is definitely a cool-ass tortoise or turtle. I think he's a turtle because... I don't know, he's a tortoise. I think he's a tortoise. He doesn't have any flaps on his hands. So, yeah, dude, no. Uh, so, guys, if you're joining in right now, guys, let me show you what I got. In a span of 30 minutes, I've gotten three, four secret rares. I've got a secret rare toxicity, a secret rare, uh, you've told a secret rare shiny frost moth, and then a fucking Charizard V Max. I got a Charizard V Max today. And if you're joining me, guys, tonight, please give a follow. I'm Kenny Boulder. I stream every Wednesday in Pokemon Cards. I stream every day, actually. So, obviously, yeah. With this luck, I was saying you, my packs will open. Bro, I mean, uh, I mean, I'm a small streamer, guys. I only I only stream, um, I'm a very small streamer, so I appreciate the, I, I gotta stay humble, so thank you. So, yeah, this is crazy. Four fucking rares already. Thank you, HK, the HK, thank you so much for the follow. Really appreciate that. Thank you so much for the follow, guys. I really appreciate it. So, we have two packs left. Uh, again, this was the first one, and this is the one that we're gonna open. Pack number six. Let's go. And this is going on YouTube, by the way. Uh, I have a YouTube channel called Kenny Boulder, and yes, uh, not to get serious here, but I am from Boulder, yeah, Boulder, Colorado. So uh, yeah, shit's heavy right now. Not gonna lie, chat, shit's heavy. So uh, we have our six pack here. Forward to the front. All right, water energy. Got Ball Guy again. Got a, you know, again, the uh, Dart Tricks. Pretty cool again. Again, I feel Naruto vibes on this guy because of the Shuriken and the mask from like the Ambu Black Ops. Then you got a Rusted Sword again. Not bad, not bad. You know, again, it's like half the sword, so I get that. You got a Cacnea. I don't know if, we haven't seen Cacnea tonight. So Cacnea is just a cactus. Cool, cactus Pokemon. Running around the fucking desert all alone with a crown on its head so again Kekneo is basically like a queen then you got a Nicknats again you got a Buzzle you got a Morpeko again feels bad man feels bad uh Eevee very cute again drowning in the middle of nowhere and yes! a reverse hollow horsey nice like I don't know about y'all but I love the reverse hollow cards they're very cool it's just you know it's, it's fancy it's stuff that you didn't get when I was growing up with Pokemon cards and then you get, and sorry, that last card is a, another Dreadmaw. Another Tortoise. Not bad. So, last pack of the night, guys. Last pack of the night. So, uh, if you're joining, uh, welcome to Kenny Boulder's channel. I'm Kenny Boulder, and I really appreciate you guys for joining me tonight. So, we have one pack left. Last pack of the night, guys. So, please check it out. All right, let's go. Last pack of the night. If we get one more shiny... Or we get more secret remnants, I'm gonna fucking lose my mind. 
Last pack of the Cold Crobat Premium Box here. Last pack magic. Let's go. Thanks for stopping by, Corners of Stars. Forward to the front. Alright. Energy. Gym Trainer. Elder Goss. Nice. Again, if I blew, like... <sighs> Elder Goss's brain would be gone. Splattered. Forever gone away. Uh, Dartrix. Cacnea. Coughing. Again. Coughing is basically a walking chemical weapon. I don't know how I feel about that. It literally, it's a poison gas Pokemon. I don't know about y'all, but if there's a Pokemon Geneva convention, Coughling will be banned. Because Coughling is a, literally a poison gas. So I'm sorry, Coughling, you are literally a danger to your friends, your allies, and yeah, you're dangerous. Snom, again, thick boy on the chair. Yeah, I love the Snoms. Then you got a Gossifer, pretty cute, love it. Spinarak with a smiley face on its back. And then, wow, holy shit! <gasps> Our fifth, number five, Shiny Secret Rare Galarian Surfetch. We have gotten five, five Shinies tonight. This is insane. And look at him, guys. Look at him right now. This is insane. Oh my god. He's so fucking cool. Yeah, a Ducky Boy. Oh my god. Like that giant sword. And again, these cards, they feel nice, okay? They feel nice. They feel good. And the shield, and he's like a duck. He's a duck. Look. He's a fucking yellow duck now. He's a he he Galarian, Secret Rare. Duck boy. Alright. Last card of the night, guys. And Professor uh, Professor Juniper, you know, re Professor's Research. Absolutely kawaii. I love you, Professor. So, not bad. Guys, holy shit. Check this out. My god. We got five shot or secret secret. We have one first the first pack we opened was a Charizard V Max. Second pack we opened was a sorry, it was this guy. A secret rare Yvental. Another pack. So, shiny secret rare toxicity. I can't say that word. Another pack. Secret rare frost moth. And our last pack of the night was a surf far fetch. I absolutely not. Absolutely not. I am I I I am a small streamer. I literally went to Target and I got this, okay? I went to Target and I bought this and I am, you know, I, I'm humbled to have all these cards. So guys, uh, actually, let's close it up here. Um, chat, thank you so much for joining me. I'm Kenny Boulder. And uh, please, please, please consider giving me a follow. I stream Pokemon cards every Wednesday at 8 p.m. Mountain Time. So you'll see me open stuff. And I have, I'm have. i trying to get more stuff. I'm trying to get more stuff. Uh, you know, I, I don't have any contacts. I, I don't go through things. Oh my God, I'm not, I don't re-steal these cards, I swear. And I'm a small streamer. And we're actually trying to get 200 followers on our Twitch channel just because that's our big thing. And we will be doing likely a charity stream. So uh, I'll probably post this on YouTube as well. So, you know, you'll, you'll, you'll be infamous, hopefully, if you're chatting the stream here. But like, uh, I want to, you know, say that, you know, uh, Boulder, that's where I'm from. I'm from Boulder. And yeah, I'm, I'm talking about the Boulder from Colorado, the place that had the horrific uh tragedy that happened yesterday and i want to say like you know my condolences to the family members and people and oh my gosh thank you so much for the sub uh hk i really appreciate that um yeah i really appreciate that i, I want to say that the tragedy was horrible and i'm probably going to do another charity stream so if we get to 200 uh i mean i'm gonna do one later sooner or later but not now not, not this weekend just because it's too soon but there will be a charity stream again, and I'm going to try to, you know, raise money for the victims that happened. Because I'm from Boulder. I was born in Boulder. I went to college in Boulder. And obviously, it's a big deal. It's a big deal. Um, and I, I want to, you know, do something with my platform. And even though this is small, I, again, I only have 200 followers. Like, less than I have not even 200. There's only, like, a lot of people in this chat. So I really appreciate you guys being here and joining if you're new. Uh, but yeah, no, I, I stream every day and... I'm, a, I'm like this is this is a hobby. I'm not. I'm not. I don't get paid. 
uh, for to, to make streams. So your donations, your, your subs, I really appreciate it. Uh, save them. Save your subs, save your donations for the charity stream. Uh, again, it's probably not going to be this weekend. It's probably not going to be tomorrow. It'll probably be in like, you know, I want to be honest, probably a week and a half from now when things are settled down, especially in Boulder. But uh, I want to say thank you so much for following me, guys. Thanks for stopping by. Uh, obviously, my condolences, hearts, and thoughts, prayers, you know, they go to the victims. And I, I really appreciate you guys being here today. So, and you, you can tell I'm getting emotional. I'm not an emotional guy, I swear. But, you know, uh, I had to say, but my, my username is Boulder. And I have to, you know, recognize that. That, that could have been me. That could have been me. So, anyway, uh, thank you so much again for stopping by. I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed the content. You have a good night, y'all. Take care.